Katarina Alves. I think I'll do Cat and then I'll take a quick break. Poochie Mama herself. Nothing but a hoochie mama. Hope you guys are big chilling though. It's a good day. of patch notes holy shit all right this is a, this will be a good character to uh transition off after like to take a break afterwards all right uh recovery increased by eight frames input window uh during harrier was changed from 30 to 37. Hmm. What was this before? One one forward by eight frames. Now it's negative a nine. And negative on hit. Is it negative on hit? Hold on. Interesting. Uh, one, one, one. Our reaction on counter hit was changed. Used to do nothing. Uh, I believe I saw it. I believe I saw it counter hit into a full combo. No, but. You do get some you do get something off the ground. Yeah, you get a back four. That's nice. Uh quality of life, honestly. Woo, full combo. Wow, that's nice. Full combo. One one four. Now negative seven to zero on block. Closer opponents on block. Yeah, you know what? This is a big swing. And since so, you'll see people just throw this out from time to time because it does this. Boom. So don't duck. Cool. So she, her, she has a she has a good mix up out of her one one string, right? This is safe. Uh, this is right. This is safe. Uh, this is uh, what's all not safe. Yeah, this is safe, but this is a mid. This is safe uh, plus, but it's a high, and then. Used to be, oh no, no, one one three, my bad, one one three. Now that's zero on block. One one four is still safe on block, or uh, unsafe on block since it's a launcher. And now you. Yeah. So there's a mix-up between her one one string now. That's nice. Uh, three or rising three, damage from four to nine or twelve. 
uh, 12 from rising and then 9 from standing. Uh, charge up, uh, change from 16 to 14, expanded, hitbox expanded downwards. This is going to be a more consistent wall combo, and, but, that will do less damage. Uh, 3-3, three, three. damage change to 4, I'm assuming 3-3-3, three, three, three. damage change, 3-3-3-3-3, three, 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 three. negative 10, negative four, 11, plus 1, so... There's stuff afterwards. This isn't that big of a change, really. Uh, a lot of this is used as one of her best wall uh, wall enders. Oh right, Harrier is a wall bounce now. I can't do that as my example. Uh, what can I use for wall bounce? Or. So I can do things like uh, R. That will be more consistent and it's still going to be very good. And the whole thing hits, you get plus one. So if the whole thing hits, you get rewarded. If it doesn't, then you get a bunch of... You, you're, if you're just trying to like cheese people out with this. But if you get the whole thing, you get the whole damage. And then you get a back four. Nice. Three, four is her. Is 16 frames. Is now safe on block. Reaction on hit was changed. Screw on uh, mid air hit. So. So uh, that got changed uh, largely because it's 16 frames and it needs a reason to exist because at 15 frames she gets a hop kick punish. So why on earth would you ever use that? So that's a that's a fair change. Now they've given it a reason to exist. It's still a mid high so you can duck it afterwards even though it's negative eight. Uh, and it has a place in combos now. I don't know when to use it. I can think of some places. I can think of some places off the top of my head that I maybe thought were hard to hit. Like, uh, if I did, what was a combo? I thought this combo was really hard. Okay, that still doesn't work out very well. Yeah. Okay, so 2-2 two, two might still be the best scenario on that. Okay, so uh, it still has its change, though. And recovery window, uh, recovery increased by 17 frames. Move in, input window for moves during Harrier change from 35 to 40s. 50 to 50. Man, she feels like she goes out of this instant now. Look at this. She, I feel like she doesn't go... It's not like this, like where she goes... Right? Like, she comes out of this immediately. Look at this. That's wild. Even though recovery got increased. Uh, I feel like that got changed. I feel like that didn't get changed all that badly. A lot of people a lot of people were complaining like, oh man, this is, uh, now this is punishable. But it's like, you just do that and you, you beat highs. So, it's good. Sleepy Swan, how's it going? Sorry, I didn't see you was in there in there a second ago. I was just focused on focused on the uh, the game at hand. Thank you for the follow, though. I appreciate it tremendously. Uh, I wish I had uh, stream notifications up, but I still have to fix that. <laughs> so in in due time. But right now, I appreciate it. How you, I hope you're having a good Thursday, though. It's a pretty good day. Feels like a pretty good day. So. Uh, other than that, a bunch of changes on her four, four, four got uh, four, four, and four, four, four got to be negative ten now. Uh, that's not that big of a deal. Remember, we were just saying that now crushes highs, uh, so it's not as obvious as you think it is. 
Uh, however, four on its own is just negative nine. Yeah, me too. I am also digging the new patch. Uh, there's a lot of fun. A uh, lot of new things to learn, which I always love. But at the same time, I think there's a lot of things that are uh, fun. Things like this, like Katarina. Katarina feels like already she's like a little bit better, especially with the 1-1 one -one change. So now like this is she has a mix up around this. So that's cool. Uh, four three. Now twenty seven zero on block. Uh, opponent reaction on normal hit and counter hit was changed. I believe this knocked down before, and then you got a free up back four. And so when I used this, I was using this as a sort of like safe homing crush or a safe low crush. Uh, that gave me a reward afterwards and now it was changed so that I get a full combo Woo! how do you how do you pick up off this now I actually don't know how to combo off this Can you combo off this huh maybe not maybe you actually just get an up back I have no clue. We'll figure it out later. Either way, it being zero on block means that you can go for this same idea of trying to crush highs. Uh, you don't get the same reward of doing a back four, but you are safe out. So you can consider this more of like an orbital use. Crush highs, stay safe. Uh, and in that, and you're not, don't completely lose your turn, right? You can do things like this, jab afterwards. And then after you've established that you're, you'll play around the 10 frame, or the zero frame game what you can do is you can do something like uh four three jab four three duck or four three duck launch four three hop kick there's a lot there's a lot to be done here from this situation uh you can almost reset situations with this right so you can go like and now you have it now you're at zero again uh harrier harrier down uh, Harrier into crouch comes out five frames faster, so you can do things like this And this is uh, a little bit scarier So cool During Harrier one added crouch status. This is why uh, This crushes highs now so you can do People try to jab check you that will be highs. And this will give you spin state. That gives you plus frames to work with. Harrier 2. Uh, change from 14 to 6. Apportion, apportion opponents on hit and, and regular hit or counter has been changed. What's Harrier 2 again? Right. So you saw this actually quite a bit yesterday as a, as the wall ender or a combo ender. Um, swap positions. Put me on the wall. This is what I, uh, oops. Man, I'm bad. All right. Anyway, I saw this a lot, uh, from the Katarina player yesterday. I believe Avion was playing him, playing her. Uh, and he was doing this quite a bit. Come on. You know what? I'm just going to make this easier myself. Right? And then you get something afterwards. So, uh, this is super useful. On top of which, now, uh, I think I feel like it's not a bad idea to just do stuff like, you know, it's six on block. Who cares? And if, if they swing into it, full combo, baby. That's awesome. I feel like uh, transitions. So overall, it looks like you can see already. Uh, Harrier three does less damage. Reaction on count, uh, hit was changed. You get a. F Hold on. Holy shit! Katarina's crazy now. Harrier four causes wall bounce on hit. Recovery on hit decreased by five frames. This is so you can get better combos on the wall. Harrier down, uh, decreased by two frames. All right, cool. Overall, all of these changes uh, tell me that this character got changed in a way to make that her Harrier game is scarier. 
I feel like this is why things like uh, Harrier transition in this scenario right here, uh, where you're looking at uh, Fort 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 Harrier, this is why this got nerfed because this is uh, safe, and then you go in, or not safe anymore, uh, and then you go to Harrier stance. So if now you're afraid of crushing, uh, getting high crushed with this, now you're not pressing any buttons. Now you're fishing for something like this, right? So you're going from here. Oh, I tried to interrupt. I got high crushed. And now I got hit low. Now I want to block low. I got hit on top, on top of my head now. Right? So now you have a mix up. It's scary because it's not like this is negative. I don't like going for this. And on top of which I can do this and then sidestep. It's negative six. So if I ever get this to, uh, if I get this blocked, then I can just duck. Boom. And if they mid check me, then they're going to be negative three, right? Like if they say do down forward one, a lot of people are negative two to negative four on that. So, uh, I see you doing it. Boom. Especially a character like Katarina, who doesn't really have much out of her down forward one. Stuff like that. Her game around Harrier has opened up tremendously. It's very, very good for her game. Uh, I should get off the wall. Uh, this move was completely useless before because it didn't give you much, right? Why would you go for this? It's a high, it's duckable, it's negative 12, and all it does is give you an up back four for a reward, which is a lot of damage, but at the same time, uh, you're putting yourself at risk for very, very little reason. And on so, uh, now it's plus one on block, so it has a use, it gives you a way to get plus frames, right? This has a use now, that's the main thing you should take away from this. Power Crush now 13 on block. There's no reason for it to be 17. The fact that it was slow and didn't move that far forward. Uh, recovery on hit decreased by four frames. Okay. Uh, this is useful. It's negative 13 and uh, I believe it doesn't push back far enough. So you can still get a 13 frame punish. Down forward one, closer on block, farther away on hit. This probably means that uh, a lot of the combos that are just like down forward one fillers aren't as good. Yeah, that's much harder now. So, uh, uh, nerf to combos that are sort of brainless. Do an actual combo, Harada says. Something like that. Down forward 1-1. One, one. Uh, able to crash the second hit when the first hit is blocked. No longer jails. I didn't know this jailed. Why would this jail? It's like contradictory to a down forward 1-1 one, one, one that's mid-high. Um, 7 on block. Plus 4 on take. So getting rid of the jailing property has now been buffed in a way that makes it scarier on hit and block. Negative 5. No worries. All right. Uh, down forward one one Harrier recovery by eight frames increase or increased by eight frames. Input window window for Harrier increased also in the same regard. So, uh, yeah, Harrier game, Harrier itself, Harrier transitions got nerfed. Harrier mixups got better. So, Ooh. my bad. Uh, down forward 2-2. Two, two. This was the mid-high mix-up. So this is a uh, down forward 2-4 is what you saw Katarina's use for screws. But it was actually also plus one on block. So this was one of her only ways to get plus frames. And I kind of snuck it in every now and then. Because when people started ducking it, you opened up the down forward 2-2. Two, two. Now this is closer on block, so it's going to be easier to punish. Uh, reaction on hit was changed on the first hit. Uh, don't know what it did before, honestly. I, I don't think it was that big of a deal, really. This doesn't change too much. Um, no, no one really didn't block punish down for two two. I'll be honest with you. Down for three. Uh, negative six on block plus two on hit. It's it's now one of those moves that it's like just if you want to just use a mid poke for the sake of using a mid poke, do it. 
It's negative six. And you still have game now around it. Uh, it used to it used to exist. It's very reason to trip people up on that low. That's the only reason it used to exist. Now that's more negative and reaction on block was changed. Now it does the uh, stuck in the mud animation as uh, some people. Which would. Can you stay crouching? Uh, I, I don't know what this is, so I'm just gonna look at it real quick instead of trying to guess the entire time. Down forward. Oh, I missed down forward. This didn't have, this doesn't have an animation or a, a spot in the frame data. Huh. Oh, left you crouching. Okay. That's whatever. That's a lot of whatever. Uh, banana peel looking thing. Uh, less, not as launch punishable by many people. So uh, only people who can twin pistons. So characters that can twin pistons now are still in the are good. But there's a lot of characters that are regular down four two launchers that where this is more useful, especially being that you're plus four on hit. Um, And then you have you're in a wall standing mix up from plus two, right? So now that you're in a wall standing mix up from plus two instead of plus zero, people can't just jab you out if you get hit. Instead, you have to worry about the wall standing four, um, or you have to, you know, there's also that opens up wall standing one, wall standing two, and uh, wall standing threes as well. Uh, there's also to consider that a back. Um, What's it called? Up back four is a thing. Also, up forward one plus two. Or up forward three plus four. These are all things that you should worry about. Down two, Harrier transition. Recovery increased by eight frames. Input window moves later. This didn't feel like I had that much of a difference when I was doing this combo. Uh, I felt like I did it exactly the same. I don't know if this was too much of a big deal. Because... This feels exactly the same to me. I'll be honest with you. So uh, recovery increased, uh, but also input was moved in the same direction. So combo potential wasn't changed all that much. Down one, closer on block. Uh, if I recall correctly, down one safe. Yeah. So closer on block just means that you lose your turn more consistently now. Uh, or sorry, down three, my bad. Down three, uh, down three, three. Now also closer on block. Uh, this is a very consistent patch note change, so we don't really need to go over it all that much. Uh, three, four, farther away on hit. Uh, counter hit was changed. Can't imagine what this counter hit animation is. Really. So they've, uh, in turn, so it feels like for Katarina is that they've buffed this move up back three plus uh, up back four, and they haven't buffed it in a way by making it actually better. What they've done actually is made it so that it's there's much more scenarios where if Katarina gets the person to swing into it, they she gets to use this, and since it puts them face down, it's very very good in that sense. It opens up her game quite a bit, so I can imagine the sense of like you do stuff like this where you do down three down three. And then maybe get someone to swing into this one. I don't see you falling for this trap all that often. But it is possible that this becomes uh, a way. You just do this. A back four. You have a Harrier mix-up coming in. That's the real benefit of a back four and these Harrier buff. Is that this is now a mix-up, right? So you get a counter hit. Counter hit, Harrier. You have a mix up. So, uh, and be uh, the reason why you have a mix up now is because you have a Harrier two, which is safe. Because Harrier one's a high, so it's duckable technically. It crushes highs, it crushes highs, and it's a high. So really think about that. And then, secondly, is that you have um, you have a safe mid now. That's a counter hit launcher, so you have to be afraid of it. Up back four. Carrier two, right? And you're not done yet. Since it's only negative six, you can still duck in the time and uh, punish him for trying to jab check you. 
this isn't all um, exactly what it's supposed to be. Back one transition, recovery increase. This is uh, consistent with the rest of the patch uh, for Katarina. Uh, I didn't use this all that much. I forgot what launch I used it for. I think it was... I used this in like one scenario where I was like, I got um, an up four four, and then I got this high splat with this, or something like that. And then I high splat with that or something like that. That's what I remember using this for. And then wall combo ender. So, uh, hair transition, not a big deal. Damage is a lot more. Uh, reaction on hit was changed. Okay. So uh, the high splat is now more consistent uh, off the ground, on the ground as well, I guess. Negative 12 on block. Uh, it was a mid, it was a mid mid before. It was safe on block, huh? Should have been using this more. Uh, either way, the point of it is that it's supposed to be negative and now it's better on, on using it in combos, so. Because it does more damage, right? Back to uh, now 16 on block, opponent closer on hit, uh, added crouch status. So uh, standing crouch, standing crouch, uh, standing high crush. Uh, this is similar to Gigas's back one, uh, but it's negative 16 now. I don't expect, people didn't use this move before. I don't expect people, expect people to use it now. Uh, although if you want to make a hard, hard ass read on someone, right? We were talking about um, negative six in the plus frames right so or negative six into uh, crushes uh i guess you can say that that could be a case here so this is one of the biggest changes i saw this yesterday from the play that we had at wednesday night fights that the katarina player was going for this quite a bit and that's because this and this were are now the same uh have the same frame data and they're both plus one on block so you can do something like this uh, recovery on hit also decreased, so you get a free up back four. Scary as shit, because now you what you're doing here. Hold on, boom, a back four. We're talking about it. Harrier mix up, very very scary now. Don't get hit by this. Thirty-seven, fifty-seven into a mix up. What is back four on frames? It's 17 frames. It doesn't necessarily replace the uh, launch potential, but the fact that it is a 17 frame mid high poke means that you have to duck it now. And now that you're forcing a mix up, uh, you can do stuff like back four and then try to catch people do stuffing else too, right? There's a lot of things here. Like just uh, it being plus one mid high means there's a, has to be a response. Added new move back four, three plus four. That's why. Oh, buddy. This character is now opened up so much. It's also a cool looking move. I'll be honest with you. It also does a head bounce animation. So you can do... Cool. Uh, I imagine that also breaks floors. One of her only ways to break floors was running three off combos, and this move sucks. Unless they buff it. Back three plus four, uh, now 14 on block. Yeah, this move led to almost nothing, and it was launch punishable. So why would it be? Why would you ever use it? Up back four. Delayed four input results in a faster attack. Now fixed. <laughs> what a silly. Uh, what a what a silly bug. Up forward, four, four. Now opponent closer on block. Easier to punish. Sure. Forward, forward, uh, two, four. Yo, this is why this dude was throwing this out so much. I was seeing this dude yesterday throw this out all the time. I was like, 
This is crazy. Why is this dude throwing out 4424 all the time? That's because this shit screws now, baby. That's crazy. Screws on regular hit, huh? And since this is a high high, um, we should see if it jails, right? It might jail. Yeah, it does. So this is this is acting properly. This jails. So it's negative nine. As long as they're not already ducking, this jails and it's safe. That's so good. That's so good. That is unreal. This is a very, very good tool. Expect people to just throw it out because why not? That was a shitty combo and it did 63 damage. Uh, I have an idea for a combo. There is a lot of damage to be had here. Oh man, longer bone. I completely missed you. My bad, dude. Uh, yeah, I think Katarina is very good. Like this is scary. This is some good stuff. She feels like she's not a uh, completely lost as a character. Running three plus one on block. They did buff running three. I skipped a couple. Uh, forward four three or during Harrier up four three. Right. Jump status is quicker. You'll get floated less. Very nice. Uh, Midair hit was changed. Block was changed. It's too bad I suck at in instant running, so I'm not going to be able to do this. Okay. Let's do a regular combo. Okay. Oh, shit. Did I see that right? Did I see that right? That's 67 damage. That's 70 damage. Running three is an unskilled ender. Holy shit. I didn't even do a good combo. That's 77 damage. Since you tried to get up uh, in a different way, it scaled a little bit differently. It scaled airborne. Yeah, it scaled airborne when she tried to get up a different way. Let me try this. Oh, 
Okay, good, 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 good. All right. If you don't side roll this, this is free damage. That's godlike. That's very, very scary. You have to quick side roll this. Have to. If I'm a Katarina player, I am looking at this immediately, right? I'm going, do you know how to side roll this? No? All right, sick. I'm going to get this on scale 21 or 24 damage. That's fucking crazy. How's it going, Shadow? Hope you're doing well today, man. Hope you're doing well. <clears throat> Running three. Uh, main buff from it, obviously, um, is that... Main buff from it, obviously, is that it is a plus one on block. So now it has some sort of use as a running move. Other than it having a different error or a different hit change while standing one change from 13 to 15 now closer on hit this is good um i like this change actually this is a buff to how i played katarina uh, i don't know if other people did the same thing as me but it's only negative six or plus five right and what i would used to do is that instead of using down forward one sometimes um down forward one which is negative one or plus five and has a, a good range, right? Like, good range. What I do is I throw out this sometimes too. And it just had a really good range and you're able to do, uh, what's that called? Harrier cancel out of it too, right? So I thought, I, I always use this because it's sort of one of those things that like, it's just, just a big scooping hitbox in front of her. Now, uh, it's, it's slightly more useful because it does more damage. Both hits do more damage, actually. So it's going to do 25 damage now. Very nice. Uh, plus negative five on hit, plus six on hit. This is a much better wall rising punish as well. I believe it's 13 frames, 13, 14 frames. Yeah. Able to cross the second hit when first hit was blocked. It used to jail as well. Holy shit. Okay, I'm not going to get to that before I lose my mind. Hold on. Wall rising 2. Closer on hit or block. Whatever. Uh, 4 crouches down for 4. Her thing. Reaction on counter hit was changed. Woo! Baby. You're joking, right? This used to do nothing on counter hit. You can see that, right? This used to do nothing on counter hit. Now I get a free up back four. And remember what we were saying about a free up back four, right? Free up back four means I get Harrier mix-ups. But this one's actually really close, so the Harrier is not that as good, right? So... Oops. Oops. This is a sequence. Look at this. Oof. This is really good. Approach enemy down for two. Her command throw, uh, which I believe is also the same animation as her side throw. This is the other side throw. I don't remember. Either way. Uh, now it can be done through Harrier. Huh. That's crazy. What did we also say was a... Huh, that's crazy. So you can do stuff like... Yeah. 
Wow, that's wild. Look at this. That's crazy. So if you get a up back four at any point during your combo and you do you can do Harrier mix-ups. Harrier mix-ups are very scary now. Harrier mix-ups are very scary. Then she has a command grab out of it as well. That's very, very scary. Very cool. This adds another element to having people try to duck. Um, and that means as well that people are going to be able to... She's going to be able to open a lot of people more up. Her game is much more fluid now. Her game is a lot more, more fluid. I might have to play Katarina again. I think... Uh, I mean, my goal actually is to play all the characters again. Um, but there's a lot of characters that I feel like are, are much better now. Or much more fun.